Hi students, uh, welcome to my uh, lecture series on uh, process plant operator. And if you if you would have followed my earlier lectures, and you might have learned uh, the following things that uh, on-off control systems, uh, which will be used for the uh, we discussed about the level control, temperature control. Okay, uh, it's a kind of cheaper process. Then we come back to the uh, there are two videos uh, that are uploaded based on P and PI controllers in the systems. Okay, now you are acquainted with the controllers and uh, continue to what we have learned for the P and P IP ID controllers. We are going to see uh, a simulate uh, I mean simulation uh, based on how people will uh, maintain the pressure in a vessel in a process industries okay we are going to show you i'm going to show you i mean on a simulator platform uh, those who people uh, um, watching for the first time i request them to follow the earlier lectures uh, so that they will be more acquainted uh, let me go to the simulator this is how i mean a graphic window of pressure controller looks like and the main important for the pressure controller is to maintain the pressure in the vessel so the job of maintaining the pressure in the tank is controlled through this control valve and we know the basics that how the controller receives the signal and what how it is what kind of signal it generates and it goes to how the pneumatics i mean how the current signal is going towards the pressure signal so that ultimately this valve will be controlled okay that is it this is some process line that two process lines and uh, pic 002 uh, five atmospheres and pic 003 one of the uh, which the stream coming at a higher pressures okay through this uh, non written valve okay this is a non written valve f40 uh, flow of direction i mean f40 represents that's okay and one line uh, is having the flow rate of uh, 1000 kg per hour and second line uh, is uh, 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 is of also 1000 kg per hour but uh, it, it is coming to be manually controlled valve okay now the present this manual control valve is 50 percent open and this is the vessel in which they have to maintain the pressure of uh, three atmospheres because the the pressure li the line uh, the pressure in this particular both the lines are five atmospheres but there is some utility that is required at the three atmospheres that is why they have to maintain the pressure in the vessel around three atmospheres you can see yeah Presently, the flow uh, exit to the flow, of course, it is at the steady state. Uh, the flow outlet to the flow is 2000 kz per hour, which is a uh, summation of FIC, FI001 and FI002. And uh, if at the moment I click the controller, I am going to open the pop up window that present the process value, that means the present process, I mean, pressure inside the vessel is a 3 atmospheres. I am also wanted to maintain the three atmospheres in the particular vessel that both are same. To maintain this pressure in the vessel, the valve has to be open 40%. That is what uh, uh, the because uh, exit pressure is the two atmospheres. Okay, presently you just don't worry about this because there is a imagine there is some flow that is going get a high pressure to low pressure uh, through this vessel. So the vessel has to be maintained at three atmospheres because the stream that is coming at higher pressure it has to be controlled now. so the sensing element at the exit of the uh, particular vessel uh, will give a certain signal to the controller based on the pressure automatically the valve will be controlled example uh, if i open this particular valve HIC001 to a higher valve position what happens the flow uh, to the vessel will be increased okay if the flow to vessel will be increased the pressure is going to rise okay the process value which is at presently three atmospheres you can see uh, now because of increase in flow because uh, at five atmospheres the pressure inside the vessel will increase for a moment but that pressure has to be controlled to come back to the three atmosphere uh, which is the controller does the job that means it receives the signal of the increase in pressure based on the control action is going to take place what kind of controller at this moment they are using let me 
if you go to the PID controls and as I can see P is 50 and I is 60 that means both are at a lower values that means it's a kind of PI control systems if I put 0 at I position or higher number automatically this become only P controller I have already discussed about there are issues with the P controller that is why in industries at the controller never come with a P controller either it is PI controller or PID controller so you have to remember this okay let me go back to the graphic window so the moment now you observe what happens the moment they open the particular valve 50 to 60 percent the process value here is going to be changed accordingly if high flow is going into the system what the controller will do try to increase the valve position presently the valve position manipulated variable is around 40 percent so automatically because of the increase in pressure in the vessel immediately the controller will take the action to open this valve okay because now process value and set value are different let us see i'm going to open this valve imagine see the things that are happening okay one second i'll put it here the moment i valve observe this lines observe this okay see the flows okay thousand this is thousand this is two thousand see the set value see the process value everything you have to observe see uh, now i'm opening the i mean hand indicating control to 60 percent suddenly the flow has raised into the system suddenly the pressure has been raised 3.1 which is greater than the set immediately the controller will test the job of bring the back to the three atmospheres that is what how it is going to the now you can see earlier it is manipulated this 40 percent now it is 40.6 40.62 and why because there is an increase in flow the man the valve has to be now it has to be at a higher position earlier it is 40 now it is 40.9 41 42 see it is trying to adjust the pressure by increasing the flow from the vessel okay now you see uh, it takes time now if you go to the trend window okay a trend window you observe you can observe okay this is uh, uh, now we can see the slightest disturbance that happened uh, let me remove this uh, manipulated variable for the moment and uh, try to yeah you can see the present process value and the present value now uh, if you see the color code is also given this color is indicating number two is indicating a uh, no, set value uh, and number this color is indicating the process value you can see the slight increase because of pressure was raised the process value increased because of the disturbance that is given to the system automatically a slight increase in pressure has been taken place now, now what the controller will do try to bring this high increase in pressure by uh, to the set point okay that is what the controller will do okay that is what see the difference now it is going to get reduced now okay uh, if, even though if i go to the controller in window let me go to the control window you will be more clear okay you see the difference if you observe here the pressure was raised because of the increase in flow that happened because i have opened the valve slowly it is raising now the controller is will bring back to this particular set point let me uh, speed up the time five times so you will observe more trends see what happens now you can with a short period of time though now the set point will try to match with that of a a process value let me order out the time code 10 times now if you go to the graphic window see uh, now the set point process value is 3.01 now the set value is 3 so slowly now the process value will be matched to the toughest set value even though even the smallest rise in uh, I mean, a pressure that happened because of the increasing the flow automatically the control now you see process value and set value both got matched this is the beauty of the controller systems okay uh, let me okay don't worry it will going to happen soon okay. 
So now both lines will be, are getting matched. Okay. If you go to the trend window also, you're going to observe. See, there is a small hump earlier. Now this hump is getting reduced. Now the process value and set value are matched. This is the first thing we can observe. And uh, what are the other things we can observe? This is called servo problem. Servo problem means uh, there is a disturbance uh, we have created and the controller will take action to reduce the disturbance. That is called servo problem. And the second problem we can discuss, uh, I mean, uh, this is called, uh, not servo problem, this is called uh, uh, disturbance problem, okay. Now let us go to the servo problem. That means now I wanted to change the set point. Now the tank is maintained at three atmospheres. I wanted to maintain this tank at four atmospheres. Okay, earlier we have discussed that is called servo problem. Now we are, go, I, mean, uh, 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 I mean, disturbance problem. Now it is a servo problem. See, now I'm going to increase the set point now. See what happens everywhere. I wanted to maintain at regulatory problem. Yeah, I was there, uh, not striking to moment. This is called regulatory problem. Now we are going into the servo problem. Okay. Four. I wanted to maintain this tank to the four. See what happens. See the manipulated variable. Early it is 40. That is, if I wanted to maintain at higher pressure, the valve has to be closed. Okay. Earlier it was around 40. Now it was drastically came down to the 18. That is how I can maintain the higher pressure in the system to reduce the flow. So the moment controller got the set higher set point, it will try to reduce the flow uh, in the control by close slightly closing the valve. Now you see automatically process value set value. The set value is 4, the process value is 4.03. Slowly the set value, it will come to the set value. Let me uh, give this on a trend window. Yeah, you see this. Now. I have changed the set value here. Suddenly it went to 4. Now the process value is picking up. Okay, uh, to the new set point. Finally, both are getting matched. Okay, uh, because uh, this will take a bit time in the process because I have increased, I mean, speed of the time 10 times. You can see this, uh, I mean, with, I mean, with a, I mean, uh, within no time here. Hope you understand we have the two things one is regulatory problem which is called disturbance problem second thing is called servo problem okay these are the two things normally in any industry i mean the problems will encounter either there is disturbance that has happened second thing i wanted to change my process conditions so these are the two things we are going to dis uh, discuss hope you understood that how uh, the pressure controller works okay slowly you can see and uh, this is uh, okay hope you understand and uh, thank you very much this is dr surendra signing off